What is going on? Dara Sticks here, and today we're going to do the week 46 update. We're going to start this with Admiral Piet going to Relic here. We got all those pieces we needed uh, from last week. We're hoping I can at least take him to six. Maybe Relic 7. We'll see uh, if we have the pieces for it or not, but that is the plan. And as we're going through here, if you guys have watched a couple of these videos, you're enjoying it, and you have not hit that subscribe button, please do that. Uh, I would appreciate it. About 85% of people that are watching these videos do not subscribe at all. So it would help the channel quite a bit. Uh, we are growing and I want to thank you all for that. So there we go. Getting this thing to relics. Uh, I'm really interested to see how this changes the Imperial Trooper team. Because uh, this will be the first relic on that team. Uh, curious how it does and now in some of the um, territory battles and stuff like that. Uh, and how, how much better it is with a Relic. So Relic 5 here. And that will get us a check mark. And I think it's for the Sea Journey if we we're doing a, a Sith Eternal. Uh, but since we're uh, probably not going to go down the Sith Eternal route right now, uh, we may put that in our back pocket. So let's see. We got to 6. Oh, what do we need for 7? We're, we are really close. Uh, I'm going to see if I have enough pieces to make those cards we're gonna be really close i'm not gonna buy them okay we've got enough we've got enough materials in there uh to make some of these cards so yeah let's do that yeah we'll be fine yep and there's our six that we need uh, so we'll just have to farm up some more stuff uh, basically, but that is fine. I want to get it to, so it'll be seven and it needs to go to eight to finish this journey. Uh, so we'll probably, it's going to, we're, we're still a couple weeks away because I need two more uh, arrow uh, purchases of arrow magnifiers. So, uh, but we are, I'm really happy with where it is actually. Uh, I'm glad I could get it to seven. Uh, we'll upgrade some of those abilities and stuff at a later date. Uh, but I did want to slap on pieces for Padme. Um, and we'll be able to put three pieces on, it looks like. Um, that's just really good. Happy about that. And then, yeah, we're missing a few pieces here and there uh, to complete it. Uh, but overall, I think we're in a pretty good position uh, to go for that one. Uh, and then do want to get uh, Jedi Knight Revan upgraded uh before gac got a little bit of time we're right in the middle of a gac so doing this upgrade but we are going to get all these ability mats and we will be applying i'm hoping i have enough material uh for all of the zetas uh and all of these abilities so we'll see how we do here uh, i am uh, really looking forward to uh using jedi Knight revan i've got a nice team for him to go with um with Yoda, uh, then Hermit Yoda, and then Basil Sean, and we've got Jolie Bindo on that team. So I am uh, really excited to see how that one does uh, and use it. Um, we'll come back to that. I want to make sure I can get all these at least to seven first before applying the Zetas and everything. Um, so, yes. But we are going to apply all three Zetas. I have plenty of the Zeta materials. I don't know if I have enough purple and omegas uh, to do all of them. So let's let's apply the first one. Makes him immune to stun and a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, so yeah, you can see just a wall of text, uh, but definitely gonna make his kit just work. Um, that buff immunity for two turns. Yeah, you can see. It just adds quite a few things. So we are going to have him at three Zetas now. Um, and I think that is going to be a good investment. Uh, I'm curious how much it helps uh, in a couple modes. But, and we will apply that one. And we are done with ability mat upgrades. We, we can do no more. Uh, but Jedi Knight Revan there. Uh, I think we got him to gear 11. And then most of his abilities are maxed out except for the first one. So definitely uh, we'll probably add that one at some point uh, soon. Um, and then here, I'm just going through. You can see what we're farming right now and everything. 
uh, fleets were still B1 and Emphis Nest. Uh, Chief Chirpa, uh, after discussing it with a couple guildmates and some of your comments, did decide I'm going to go for Wicket. Uh, just kind of doing the math on that, it looks like it'll take me about two months probably to farm up the shards for it. And we're, so it delays the journey a little bit, um, but we should be able um, to get some of these. So I think Wicked is going to be where we go. Low grade, we can obviously still need to upgrade a lot of these, um, but we're going to slowly but surely work on them. Put low grade up to 85. Um, and then apply some abilities with what we have left over. Uh, and that will finish off uh, this this week with a couple of these Ewoks getting uh, a few more abilities and stuff. So I think that's um, will be a good use there. And get us three 3PO that we can throw on the Padme team, CLS, wherever we kind of need it. He's kind of uh, plug and play on those two teams. But uh, definitely going to be useful. So you can see our Padme team is looking really good. Put Dar Darth Revan there just as a placeholder, like his unlock, uh, since we finished the other uh, one. But we'll see kind of where we're at. Uh, so Imperial Troopers, definitely an upgrade on them. Empire, uh, Geo's Jedi Knight Revan. You can see kind of the team I threw together for now. Uh, Phoenix, we haven't been working on a whole lot, just picking up shards here and there. Uh, troopers, Bounty Hunters. Uh, we are going to work on a couple of bounty hunters because I want to finish off um, that team so I can use it in C-Pit uh, to give us another team, and I only need like a couple characters there. So get the final star there on B2. Uh, that finishes it off. We were getting that out of the stores uh, when it was showing up. So yeah, we can finish that one. We'll put them up to like 80 and kind of call it done for now. Uh, just slowly but surely working on it. He still needs ability mats and everything, um, but that will come in time. But we are making good progress here on these teams. Uh, I'm really happy with where the account is at right now. You can see we're just kind of scrolling through, looking at a few other things. Uh, Razor Crest, we're ready to go once we get the unlock there. Um, but yeah, we're going to double farm Queel and that uh, Thai Bomber. Uh, next week and I think that's going to help us uh, really catch up on those shards so we can get to the ex uh, executor unlock so that is week 46 uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it I uh, kind of see account progress didn't upgrade a whole lot of characters this week uh, just focused on a couple uh, but they are going to be really impactful to the account here's where we're at right now top 200 and squad and fleet we're staying top five most of the time so if you guys enjoyed, like, comment, subscribe, and as always, thanks for watching.